All right, third tries the charm. Let's play the convict. I was gonna try the convict and other things, and I don't know, whatever. This is this is a cursed game. Uh, this is a cursed series. This is a cursed day. Let's see if I can break that, or if if somebody's going to come knocking loudly on my door, uh, demanding I don't know blood blood reparations or something. We'll see. Uh, huh. Yeah, I'm not even going to give context for what's going on at this point, because no context. Yep, and I immediately got hit. Great. I have not played this game in, like, a year. I don't really... I don't really... I don't hate Gungeon, but it's always one of those where it's like, I want to love it, but every time I try and, like, get into it, it kicks my ass. Which is not, <laughs> not a good time uh, for this right now. But whatever, we'll figure it out. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Oh, oh, did I... Did I kill that guy by rolling over him? Can I do that? Is that a thing? I have no idea if that's a thing. And there we go. Okay. But yeah, no, this is this is one of those games that I always, always wanted to get, like, really, really good at. Uh, you know, I watch sleep cycles and whatnot. You can dodge roll over tables now. Oh, that's good. That would explain how I could roll over a table previously. Okay, but, you know, every time I tried to... Whoop, and... Ate that one. Ow. I tried switching to the shotgun and shooting him. It didn't work as hot as I wanted it to be. Okay, I'm full up on ammo and that's probably gonna disappear. But we'll find we'll figure it out. So rolling does do some damage. Okay. Uh all you gotta get is curse bullets. With your massive curse level, you'll one-shot everything. Ah, that would be lovely. If only if only uh life translated to mechanics. What are what is this? What are these things? What are you? Oh, it has some armor on it. That's cool. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, so that... Okay. These are... These are scary things. Okay, we got the big guy out. At the very least. Okay, I'm just gonna hide behind here. The bullet cultist is scary. Okay, let's figure this out. Yeah, the rat comes for ammo. Yeah, I know he does. Uh, it does look like you get partial ammo ammo drops, but yeah. Uh, one of my biggest problems that I ever ran into in this game was just like, I got all these cool guns and I could never use them. Uh, you know, I was constantly, I was constantly starved for ammo and like, I will bring this up on videos about like, uh, frequently about why I don't like Gungeon that much. Because I was always stuck with the t-shirt cannon, like, it was, it was actually disheartening how often I had that thing. And how rarely I had anything better than the t-shirt can. I had a couple of good runs. I got kind of far. But it was always it was always just like this uh this just sad thing where I was just like I'd get to the end and I just didn't have enough health or who knows what. But yeah, there's more ammo now, which should be a huge plus. Oh. They try and predict where you're going. Okay, well, I'm gonna try and use the shotgun. I don't actually know if the, uh... The shotgun is worth A lot of books now. Oh! I thought they fired directly at you. I guess I shouldn't have gotten as close as I did, but whatever. We'll find out. Let's see. Why not mod infinite ammo in? Uh, that was actually a temptation, but I could never figure out how to do it. Uh, now that I know how cheat engine works, I probably could actually do uh, infinite ammo if I really wanted to. But let's let's try without first, because uh, it kind of sucks when like weapon usage is going to be your your main sticking point for why you won't play a game. Uh, I actually had the same. Uh, same feelings about this game that I had with Rage. It's like, I kind of want to like this game, but man, just running out of ammo is just... I just don't want to deal with it. But if we're lucky, uh, we won't have to. And that'll solve all the problems. But if it does get to the point where I'm still enraged over the utter lack of ammunition, then yeah. Cheat, uh, cheat engine will be the way to go. So what is this? Jar of bees. How do we even use these? I think it's space bar. Let's let's try that. But ultimately, the other problem is this is kind of a bullet hell game, and the only bullet hells I'm good at are uh, mother gunship and tower of guns. I'm very good at uh, well, no, and immortal redneck and a couple other ones. I'm really good at uh, 3D, uh, 3D bullet hells. I'm 
god awful at the PD once. I, I kind of did okay in Steradin, but that's mostly because of cheese tactics more than anything else. Oh, uh, I think that's locked. Okay. I guess let's just go over here. Am I excited about uh, Rage 2? I am, actually. Oh, you can zoom your mini map out. I don't know how to do that. Uh, I am still riding high on adrenaline. Okay, uh, let's see. But yeah, no, I'm, I'm looking forward to Rage 2. I, I never beat the first one. I barely even played it, honestly. I just did a couple of missions and I'm like, so ammo. Uh, I'm gonna try it again. Uh, <laughs> I might try Rage, uh, Rage 1 with infinite ammo. What is this? Oh, Glass Guon Stone. I, oh, but it's fleeting defense. I bet it gets broken easily. Minimap zoom is tab? Well, that's the pull up the map. That's not exactly a zoom. Oh, tab and scroll. Uh, that only works for the map map, from what I can tell. Whatever, it doesn't matter that much. Okay, uh, but yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm looking forward to uh, playing Rage 2 because it looks like they've learned from it. It looks really nice. Okay, Glass Guan is Garbo. It's a consumable. Ah, I was really hoping uh, the Glass Guan would be one that would like come back occasionally. I don't know. I was, I was hoping there we'd actually get some like power ups here. Wow, you uh, <laughs> really kind of skimping on me here. <laughs> uh, yeah. Shop probably has key. Shop had key. All right, and we've get the we get the big iron. Oh, I see. That just warps us back. Well, we're still keyless apart from this. Let's let's just go fight the the boss, and we'll see how it goes. I'm waiting for Doom Two, Rage Two, uh, Dark Siders Three, Kingdom Hearts Three. Next next year is going to be the year of the sequel to some degree. Uh, oh God, we are not a pretty uh, pretty person. Oh, at least we get our. Yeah, I'm not very good at avoiding these shots. I'll get better at it. I think once you kind of separate the twins out, it helps a lot. Unfortunately, we're not going to get the health up, and that'll just be life. Okay, so he's pissed now. But the, since there's only one of them... It'll be easier. Oh god, aiming for the blank spots in their defense is going to be tough. But that's okay, this gun's much better. Okay, yeah, focus the one with the glasses. Now we know. Now let's grab the, uh, the bucks. Get the pulse cannon. Now, one thing I never liked about this game is the fact that if you take any damage at all during the boss fight, you just straight up don't get a, um, you just straight up don't get, uh, a max health boost. I always found that to be kind of frustrating. Uh, it was kind of like an ultra-punishing version of the, um, what is this? What are you? Take a break, come, come back later. Nope. Okay. Uh, so that's the save and quit. That's cool. And yeah, don't forget to use blanks. Yeah, I'm really bad at using blanks just because I totally forget they exist. Play better. <laughs> Har. Um, but like, Binding of Isaac was, uh, was always, I want to say fairly rewarding with how it handled, um, it deals with the devil, in my opinion. Um, extra health is just for dodgy boys. Yeah, but like, three, six health is kind of, kind of low. Uh, to actually win. I don't know, I just like the deal with the devil system in uh, Binding of Isaac. Oh, I didn't even see the pissed off Navi. Alright, whatever. But like, I don't know. I feel like getting, uh, taking damage is already punishment enough. Uh, making it worse uh, is just... Oh, is this heartening? Okay, probably stay away from that. Oh, I cornered myself, and that was not a good plan. Okay. Well, surprise surprisingly, I'm I'm getting I'm getting the hang of it. It's just gonna take some time. <sighs> oh shit. I am 
pure garbage at fighting these guys. And of course, he's got his uh, he's got his buffy little friend there. Okay, there we go. I really hate those buffer guys comboed with the Iron Maiden. I just never liked fighting the Iron Maiden. Homing, homing, no, I guess they're not exactly homing, they just fly at where you currently are. Uh... What the? Okay, that's a new one. There's a bunch of new critters that we have to deal with. No, I don't know. I... There's a lot you have to get used to in this game, and I'm not very good at it. Right, there's also the, uh, the primed bullet or whatever it is that you have to get at some point. Oh, and it's you again. Oh, except for you're not summoning dudes this time around. Yeah, I guess really, realistically, uh, they're not so bad. Ow. Shit. Yeah, this is not going to be a great run, I can guarantee you. I'm not- I'm not Sleep Cycles, by the way. To anybody that was hoping for the second coming of- of... Well, that... Uh... I guess absolute master of this kind of game. I am me. I am bad at these games. I can be good at some games. For this game, ooh. Ooh, it's gonna take some time before I get there. Now, does that actually... Okay, that only refills my ammo for big iron. Nothing else. Well, that, that's fine. Let's see, doesn't the primer only appear on the shop if you haven't made the bullet that can kill the pass or something? Yeah. No, I still... I... Ugh. It's gonna take a while before I get to the point where I can even make the primed primer or the primed bullet or whatever it is. Like, I can't even beat the dragon. Let alone any of the uh, special story missions at the end or anything like that. Ow. Oh, rolling directly next to that guy is a bad move. But no, it, it's going to take some time. Uh, it's going to be hard. Okay, well, we don't have any keys here. And we got the boss. Hard pass on that, at least for a little while. Let's see if we can get some more things. I'm gonna die trying to traverse this pit. Not great at the movement in this game. Oh yeah, I'm... I'm very close to death, but I forgot that uh, his bullets bounce. I guess I'll just hang out there until they die. This is going to go great. I can tell already. Oh Oh, that's fine. I still can't open that. Well, we could head for the shop. I might as well. I might as well buy health. <laughs> it's not much. It is not much. Well, let's go get the. Let's get the chest. Let's see what we got. What is this one? Infuriating note. You've been had. What does that do? I assume that does nothing. I. That might actually be one of the other uh, grumps that I ran into in this game. There was a lot of situations where uh, uh, I just got like totally, totally useless garbage, and I was just like, "Oh, that that's helpful." Okay, this item keeps the rat from stealing anything. Oh, that's a little bit better than I thought it was. But I don't know. Uh, and I thought I rolled through that, but I guess it hit me and then I rolled or something. Oh! Hi. You're interdasting? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna lose this one. We'll see. Uh let's see. 
Let's see, there's an inventory screen that tells you what things do. Oh, hi. That's new. I've taken your stuff, but you keep pushing through. I'll, ha I'll have to try harder, so rats off to you. Oh, that's cute. So that's, uh... So that's how we, uh, see our inventory. Okay. I am... I'm on the edge, and I should be... Uh, I think this is the absolute worst day this game could have came out. I mean, we'll be... we'll probably be fun. I'm gonna preemptively blow these up so I don't accidentally just, like, randomly shoot or roll through them. Like a complete boob. I've done that. I've done that before. It's never pleasant, and I always die. Okay, can't do anything with this. So go back into that one room and flip the table into the pit. I guess it's an achievement. Huh. Alright, sure. I think I always played as the, uh... No, not this one. I think I always always played the um, the soldier. This room? I don't see a table to flip into any pits necessarily. What about this one? Ah, this one. Well, I don't think I actually flipped it into the pit. Rolling through barrels doesn't explode them. Oh, well that's good. I'm gonna still do it anyway. Ooh, gun muncher. I'm not actually sure if I wanted to munch any of my guns. Because I think the pulse cannon is pretty good. Big iron's not bad. Sawed off. I've heard is good. I have no way of knowing. Okay, well, we are on our last legs. Let's go die. Well, I've fought this guy before without taking damage. Hard as shit, and I'm, this is probably not going to be this run. Uh, I never remember how long he's going to do that that one for. It's mostly going to be a problem when he is um. When his like little guy shows up. Well. Oh. We might actually make it through. Okay. Got him! Without taking a hit! Wow! I was, uh, expecting worse. I'm a monster. All right, so we get the uh, napalm gun, some extra health, and some more health. Good. <sighs> yeah, the beholster I can fight. He's actually probably the best, uh, the boss I'm best at. Uh, I'm shit at all of the uh, bosses on the first floor. I'm real good at him, and then everybody else is like, not even worth mentioning. This is a good gun. Great AoE. Okay. Are those things I can shoot? No. It's you. Whoa. Hi? Did they die? I guess they did. Alright. <laughs> well, Big Iron is, is like, completely out. Okay, cool. Wow, it is shotguns all the way down here. I don't actually know if you have to kill those guys. Oh, I hate the bubble bobblers. Actually, if I just leave fire behind for them... He should just die. Now, will these things leave me alone after a while? Can I just leave the room? Okay, there we go. Oh, that didn't work. I was too busy dodging the bullets, I forgot to dodge the bomb. Okay, well that's the dangerous one gone. And then these things are, these things are chumskis. 
Still low on ammo, though. Hopefully we get some more of those kind of handy brown boxes. Because I think the brown boxes refill all your guns, just a little. And, like, if we could actually reliably get a couple of those, I wouldn't mind it so much. Otherwise, let's just go back to the unlimited ammo thing and we just kind of go with whatever. Who knows? <sighs> okay, so this thing's almost out of juice. I might as well use it for two shots and then shelve it. <laughs> That's really effective. I mean, obviously, it's a gigantic problem. Uh, uh oh. I forgot he does that. Ah, rolled right into that one. That's one thing I can't. I don't think I can chain roll in this game. And oh, oh! I thought he was dead. I forgot about him. I forgot they did that. Can you tell? I haven't played this game in a while. I don't even know what killed everything. Shit died for some reason. I don't think I was that accurate. Remember the bee jar. I will always forget the bee jar. Let's try it here. Bees! Oh. Huh. Okay. Bee jar's pretty good. Okay. Uh, let's got the... Nope. Yeah, I can't do this. Okay, so 25% on your other guns if you pick up the new ammo crate. Cool! Unfortunately, I haven't seen one in a while. We got like two drops in the very beginning, that was about it. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, so let's... let's refill big, big iron. Now, that doesn't actually give any ammo on any of my other guns. But at least it'll refill one of the ones I have. We're also rolling some really good guns here. Which is surprising me. It's a puzzle room. Now I know that I know that room. I I've traversed it before with flight, where I didn't have to think about it. it it's part of the whole primed primer dealio, if I remember right. Does wander like in Gungeon now? I think it stresses me out in the exact same way that it used to. I may be a little bit more zen about it. So I guess story time for Gungeon. Uh, this game was kind of poisoned before I could ever, uh, before I even, like, played it. If that makes sense. Uh, so, this is one of those games that everybody was looking forward to, but I was kind of ambivalent on. It looked neat, but, like, I could already tell that I was just gonna be, you know, okay about it. Uh, but everybody and their mother, for whatever reason, uh, was asking me, when are you gonna play Gungeon? Like, at the time, I did play a lot of, uh, roguelikes and stuff, but it was, uh, yeah, Storytime Wanderers Bad at Gungeon. This is true. Um, what is this gun? Prototype Railgun. Seems fun. I'm too- I'm poor as dirt, though, so I'm probably not gonna go for it. Um, but so, like, I wanna say I got, like, half a billion people asking me if I was going to play it. And... To be totally honest, it's very easy to become meh about a game. Uh, if people keep demanding that you play it, or, like, ask that you play it. Just because, yeah, I mean, it's not, it's not that fun. Uh, just fielding the same question day in, day out. Wanda, are you going to play Gungeon? Okay, save for the, save for the prototype. Good to know. Many ask you to play Minecraft. Not really, actually. I, I get, I get very few requests to play Minecraft, ever. I think people got, uh, pretty satisfied with that one. Scrap mechanic, that's another one uh, that people would incessantly ask for. And, you know, at times I've thought, yeah, maybe I'd like to go back to scrap mechanic, and then I get somebody demanding it, and I'm like, well, never mind. That's right out. Because I, I don't really enjoy, uh... I don't really enjoy uh, feeling like I am I'm effectively a monkey for people's entertainment. I mean, that's exactly what I am, but, I, you know, it's like... 
uh, calling but somebody in this modern day and age, you know, that might be working like a service job, calling them the help. I, I've seen that more often recently, and that is like the most insulting thing ever. And so it's like, you know, when, when people are, you know, asking, Wander, are you gonna play... Wander, play Scrap Mechanic. Wander, play Warframe tonight. You know, I'm like, you know, maybe... Uh, actually, yesterday, uh, I got kind of mad at this game passively without even, like, playing it. Uh, yesterday I was having some trouble in mo uh, Mother Gunship because I wasn't having fun. There were no new guns, and I was just kind of infuriated. Uh, infuriated over the whole thing. And so, uh... Somebody's like, hey, Wander, I know what you should do instead. Go play, uh, Enter the Gungeon. I'm like, no, don't, don't say that to me. Like, if I'm having a tough time in the game, I'll quit when I want to. I, I don't want somebody to, like, you know, start telling me to play other games. It wasn't just, like, one person telling me to play, uh, Gungeon. It was, like, several people. Probably because, uh, Admiral Baru and, uh, Sleep Cycles had access to this early. And, like, I can totally understand and sympathize why, why people want these things. It just gets really frustrating out of my end to be, like, you know, uh, to get so many requests. It's like if, uh, and I, I don't even have, like, a good example for you. I guess it's like if your teacher kept hounding you over whether or not you were going to do your homework. It's like, yes, yes, I probably am, or not, who knows? But you demanding it of me constantly is not going to change this. Oh. I know this is like, people have yelled at me for this opinion in the past. I just, I don't know, I like, I like feeling like a human being sometimes and not, uh, not just enter entertainment man. Uh, okay, uh, let's see, do we have anything else? We have gotten no keys, I have a hundred. Chances are we're not going to be able to buy the prototype. I don't think you get money from barrels and stuff. Let's see, is this the first run since the update? Uh, first one that's made it anywhere. The last couple were, uh, were halted by mad roommates. And, well, no. Neighbors. Eh, bit of both. Alright, let's see what this is. Tank? Or the weird ghost ball? Oh, it's this guy. Okay, well, you know what? I can fight this guy. Is that another gun muncher? Yes, there is. I don't know if I want to test my luck, though. I actually kind of like the guns that I've got right now. Uh, I'm terrible at leading shots on this guy. Oh, shit. Probably should use that gun. Am I even hitting him? I actually... Oh. Uh, sometimes I wish I rolled a little bit faster. In this game. Okay. I don't know if I can hit him like this. Oh, there goes my HP up. Ah, got hit by that one too. One other thing I gotta realize is sometimes you gotta roll to and away from bullets. But yeah, I, I was never very good at fighting this guy. He had such a massive health bar. I was okay at fighting him. What was it? The, uh, the priest was the, uh, was the big deal for me. I, I could not fight the, the gun priest on the fourth level. Well, that's okay. And yes, I know I have the blanks. Um, uh, to be quite honest, trying to use the blanks is actually really tough for me. See, I'm at 119. I don't think I'm going to be able to get enough cash. Use the bees. Oh, shit. Why did I do that? Oh. Hi. Well, 
Well, he needed that. This run is sunk anyway, so I guess I'll give it to him. I almost didn't take damage. I took, what, three damage? Whatever, it doesn't matter. Like, s straight up, I'm going to make some pretty bad misplays here while I get, uh, get used to this game again. I totally forgot about that. Okay, I don't... I, you don't get money from uh, from breaking these. So, we're pretty much out of luck. I, I'll just go buy the uh, one of the keys. Do I buy the, buy the full heart? Nah, I can live without it. At least for a little while. Okay, and we get whatever the hell this is. Flame hand! Oh, cool. Okay, and there's nothing else, so let's get out of here. I mean, I've made it pretty far. Despite the fact that I'm, like, hellaciously rusty at this game. Okay. Well, I was using big iron, so... Uh. Cornered from the get-go. Just me, are these books like way tougher? Or I've just been missing him real consistently. This is one thing I have about shotguns in uh, 2D games. They always, they always like feel like they're the most inaccurate thing ever. Things ever? I don't know. Um, let's just send out the bees. I think the bees might actually be kind of a help here. Oh, it's a die 20. It's it's got different patterns. It it rolls itself. That's cool. Enemy health scales with floors. Now nah, I'm aware of that. That was actually something that always kind of bothered me. Uh cuz it it throws me off a little bit. You know, I keep expecting to kill the the basic bullet men. Uh and then not and it's very confusing. Hoping to avoid both of them, and I am dying. There we go. Well, we get a key. I mean, we're doing okay for my first run back. Dodging things is just always going to be my my absolute worst. Whatever, we'll see. Uh, I guess on the topic of people demanding uh, me to play things, it's been pretty quiet lately. Mo most people have been uh, shockingly respectful. I'm going to die. Maybe not in this room, but probably in the next one. But no, people have been pretty respectful lately. Uh, it might also help that I've uh, blacklisted the word uh, scrap mechanic on my, my YouTube channel, which certainly helps. Um, but no, I had... Uh, oh, was there an ammo box? Oh, there was an ammo box. Well, there's another ammo box. I probably shouldn't have buffed that one up, but whatever. Oh. Yeah, he took it. So, I guess the you've been had isn't useful. Maybe? I could be wrong. Oh, ammo box at shop. Okay. Yeah, I should not have fixed this one. Um, but anyway. So, uh... So, obviously, getting rid of scrap mechanic help. I've been seeing a bunch of people demanding... Ah, ghost showed up on me as I was trying to deal with the... Eh, whatever, it's fine. Um... I guess I'll finish the story, seeing as this is the end of the episode. And we'll switch characters or something, maybe. Uh... How many Starbound or Stardew Valley requests do you get? A uh, number, not too many, but I, I do get Stardew Valley requests frequently enough. I got 14 I could buy. I see Rocket, Op. Op might be interesting. Um, but, uh, so, Roblox. 
I don't know how or why, but Roblox has been getting like an insane amount of requests uh, lately, and I kind of wish I wouldn't, because I have like zero interest in that game, and it kind of confuses me uh, how many people are demanding it. Because I'm like, I, th there is there is no point in my channel's history where I've uh, <laughs> I've given reason <laughs> reason to believe that I'd ever play Roblox. And I get a lot of requests. But yeah, I got one message uh, recently that was like, uh, you know, play Roblox or I'm unsubscribing and telling all my friends to unsubscribe. And I'm like, huh. I don't usually get threats when it comes to these things. It was silly. Buy a scrap mechanic. All right, well, that's going to be, I guess, the first episode. That was not as bad as I thought it was going to be. And hopefully, hopefully I can maybe improve or something. I don't know. We'll find out.